Hey everyone, uh, Sales for Shorts here. In this video, we're just going to talk about how to create a list view button and how to add and remove it. So we'll just do this on the account object. So basically, what we want to do is add an, add another button on this layout. Um, let's just go straight to Edit Object, and then from here, let's go to List View Button, List View Button Layout then yeah there's a couple of ways you can create a new button so you can e e either do it with um, buttons links and actions from there and then go new action or new button or you can just um, do it straight from the layout so I'm just going to create it straight from here for now um, we'll go click here to create a new list custom button then let's just call this my button um, it's not going to do anything for now, but yeah, I'm just showing how to do it. So you've got a couple of options here for the detail page link, detail page button, or list button. So we want to do a list button. Um, yeah, next step is you can basically decide how what you want it to do. Um, so you've got different options here. You can execute JavaScript as well, and then put some JavaScript code in here. Um, content, yeah, you can decide content source, URL, JavaScript, or you can use a visual force page and then select your visual, your visual force page from here as long as you've got a controller, standard controller for your object, that should be okay. Um, yeah, but for now, let's just go with um, URL. Uh, let's see if, yeah, that's not gonna work. Custom button link field is empty. I wonder if we can just port HTTPS. Let's see if that'll do anything cool. And save. Ah, enter a valid URL. Hmm, let's maybe try and just use our standard domain here. Not sure if that's gonna work. Yeah, <laughs> give that a shot. And hit save. Alright, cool. So it looks like um, this works. So we've got our button created. Let's go back to our list view, refresh this. Um, it's probably not going to be here yet because we need to select it. So let's go back to list view button layout. Um, go to edit. And then from here, you'll see available buttons. So just select your button and then click add. And yeah, if you want to get, if you want to clean up all this stuff here, it's not showing all of them, but like if you wanted to remove some of these, you can just um, remove the checkboxes here. I'm just going to leave it like that for now and click save. So if I go back to accounts and refresh, we should see the new button. All right, cool. And there it is. Um, basically, all it's doing is, yeah, it's probably not going to work, but <laughs> uh, yeah, that's how you create a button and add and remove it from the list view. So obviously, if you wanted to remove it, just go back in here and then and then you can uh, remove your custom button. All right, cool. If you found this video helpful, please subscribe and check out our other videos. Thanks.